It's Teresa. Boys, what are you guys doing? I just, um, I got in the shower today and then I tried to do like a beachy wave. But uh, anyway, I just put the Ozzy scrunch in it. It looks like a birch broom in the fits. I don't, like the ends needs to be cut and stuff, right? But remember that Ozzy scrunch? Whenever I smells that, it brings me back to the days when I was a teenager. We used to go to the summer camp out in Lewisport. And everybody had Ozzy scrunch and salon selectives. Yeah, mother trying to send me now with the tame. Right? But everybody had Ozzy scrunch. So I used to just take it from my friends, right? And there were six girls then in one little tiny cabin with uh, one outlet trying to get a shower now before any, any of the boys got up. Right? Fun times. But... Anyway, it was fun times. I even got a video, uh, like someone posted a picture of me from camp years ago. And there was a, yeah, um, there's a picture of me with my hair and trying to get my hair to stand up. Because remember when you used to do your bangs? Like I had a friend, I'm not going to say her name now, but like you could see her 10 minutes before she come around the corner. Because like the hair, the bangs used to come first. Imagine, like mine were never that out of control, but I do have a have a have a picture of me trying to spray my hair up. Right, you used to pull your hair up, spray it, and then put the hair dryer on it. And then um, someone got a picture of me like that posted on the internet. I love it when you when you're you know you're on Facebook and then says so and so tagged you in a picture. Yeah, loves it. Right, Cause especially if you haven't been with them in a while because you're thinking now, what in the world's this now, right? But you know what Facebook did to me the other day? After I posted that picture of me with the curls in my hair, Facebook went and put me on their beauty page, promoted that, that video on their beauty page. Imagine, like James Charles, my son, watch out because this is coming for you. Imagine, like I rarely even wears makeup, but I guess, I mean, beauty is not makeup now, is it? Right? It comes from the inside too, right? And sometimes it comes from foolishness and making people laugh. So that's what I did. Anyway, it's still fun. I'm having lots of fun, but I'm having like lots of new people are watching my videos now from other places, other Newfoundland, and I love it, right? But I just realized, you know, we're not going to be able to go nowhere this summer. So we're going to have to be spending more time at home. And I know that some of you likes listening to me because you likes my accent because it reminds you of home and stuff like that. And uh, so I know that you can't get here. So I want to go visit your homes. Tell me where you're from. I want to go visit places in Newfoundland summer. Where should I go? What should I do? Like, you know, I don't want, I want to be social distancing and stuff like that. So, you know, you got to think about that. But what in Newfoundland is your favorite thing to do? My favorite thing is probably going to Plate Cove, where my mother's from. And I love the Trinity Bonavista area. My absolute favorite, I love the Twine Loft in, in Trinity. My favorite restaurant. And I just love walking around the streets of Trinity. And I like the theater that's there and everything. So, you know, what's your favorite thing to do? Let me know. And um, so if you're new here, welcome. And uh, I hope you guys has a great day. See ya.